want to talk a little bit about the nofollow status that almost all Blogspot blogs have because it's that way by default when they first set it up and most people don't realize that it's beneficial to change it. So what I use is a little program or an add-on for Firefox called Search Status and it you can download it for free at the I'll, I'll put a link on my on my blog post so you can find it. It's easier than trying to spell it. But anyway, to give you an idea, I have it running here, and you can see right down here at the bottom, it tells me what the page rank is and what the Alexa is, and I also have it set up to show to highlight no follow links. So if I go to just about any blog on here, and this is Entree Card, which is uh, what I use to get more blog traffic. And while I'm here, I'll just go ahead and click that drop button so I get a credit anyway. But I want to show you something real quick. If you look at any of these that have a lot of comments on them, here it has 10 comments. When you click that comment button, you notice how all of these add uh, links back to the person's website are pink. And the reason is, it's a nofollow link. They don't get any link juice out of that at all. Well, putting it do follow, in other words, getting rid of the nofollow, encourages people to leave more comments and that's why I want to do it. The, the point is it was originally done to reduce spam and it doesn't work. People spam just as bad whether they're on there or not. So I'm going to come back to my uh, blogger dashboard and I'm going to pick one of these blogs that I've got running on here just to show you how this works. And uh, let's let's grab this one right here. View this blog. And I want to customize it so I click on customize up here. Go to edit HTML. And what I want to do is click this expand widget templates and I'm going to put my cursor right here and I'm going to come up to my uh, web browser and say uh, edit find and put no follow in the little box down here and say next and there it's going to find a statement down here in the in the code and what we're looking for, it says a expression colon href equals data comment author. That's where the person who made the comment, their author goes in. And it says rel equals no follow. All you have to do is highlight that and delete it. Then come down here and save your template. That's all there is to it. And uh, you'll see if I come back here. Oh, one more thing. If you want to go into settings and you want to go into comments. You want to show comments to registered users so they'll have to log in through OpenID or a Google account or some way so that you can get the little box to pop up so they have to put in the CAPTCHA code. That cuts down on the spam a lot. I like to embed them below the post so they don't have a pop-up window. And uh, comments, default for posts, new posts have comments. So I want to show that on everything. Hide the backlinks. I don't care about backlinks. If you want to use backlinks, you can put those in. Uh, but the big thing is, I want to come down here and says comment moderation. Check always. So that comes up and has me moderate it. If I want to, I can put an email address here and it'll notify me whenever there's a new comment that's made. So I can go in and moderate. But, but I check these often enough. I don't worry about it. I just go in there and look at them. And make sure you have this show word verification for comments. Check that yes. Show profile images on comments. I put that yes so the person's picture will show up if they have a blogger account with a with a picture in it. And then comment notifications. I can put a whole bunch of emails in here. When I'm done, I just click save settings. So this blog is ready to go. If I go over here and view the blog, and here's one with a comment. So if I click on one comment, you'll see this. This is not pink because it's a it's no longer no follow. It's a do follow now, and that's what I want to do. I actually found by going and looking at my logs uh, after I ran that for a little while that I actually get some link juice back from it too because people appreciate the fact that you're making it do follow instead of no follow, and they're going to leave comments for you more often. And once they understand this concept, more and more people can do this. And we can build a blog community out of it. That's what Entree Fund is, or Entree Card is all about anyway. So why not go the next step and go ahead and make your blog 
a do follow blog too. I'll see you around online.